Hey, Joe, we, we just learned that Garrett Cole had tested positive for COVID. The Yankees have had several kind of outbreaks throughout the course of the season, like many other teams. Is there anxiety in there when you find out one of your teammates tests positive? Um, yeah, I, I just found that out uh, just because I heard them asking Gary those questions. So, um, yeah, no, I mean, it didn't, didn't seem like it. Uh, I think, you know, Gary kind of said, well, you know, we're just going to follow protocol and, um, you know, see where it goes from there. So, you know, obviously hoping the best for Garrett. You guys seem to have such good momentum going after that Marlins series. Why do you think the offense really slowed and, and you guys are just kind of flat this, this mm -hmm. evening? Uh, yeah, I, I mean, I, I thought uh, Lopez pitched really good. Um, you know, he, he, he has really good stuff and, uh, you know, he's making his pitches and, you know, I think sometimes that's how baseball goes. But, um, you know, I, I, I think, you know, we'll come out tomorrow and bounce back and whatnot. But, um, you know, it's... Uh, you know, he, he, he really had his good stuff today. So uh, you kind of tip your hat and, and try to move on to the next game. Clearly not the end result you would have liked as a team. But when I spoke to you in Miami, you talked about how much you were looking forward to wearing pinstripes. Were you able to take anything in this evening? Yeah, it was a it was a definitely a crazy, um, a crazy day. Uh, you know, it's obviously different, you know, playing my first game on the road. Um, you know, this this first game here felt felt fresh and, uh, you know, wearing those pinstripes and you know, obviously growing up watching that was uh, it was pretty amazing. And, and, and the roll call with the fans and whatnot, it's uh, you know, it's a it's a special place to play. So I'm just, I just feel honored to play here. And, um, you know, obviously it would have been great to get a win. But, um, you know, it was still a special, special day for me. Tom Merriam, please unmute. Charlie, how much of an adjustment do you think it's going to be for you playing in Yankee Stadium after playing in Texas the last few years? Um, I don't, I don't really think it's uh, he, might be a huge adjustment. I think more defensively um, might be a little bit different uh, in terms of just you know the the you know the fence and how far it is away and um, how balls carry. And, and and in Texas, I was kind of dealing with a roof uh, also. So um, here, obviously, there's no roof. So. Um, you know, I don't think, I mean, at the end of the day, I don't really try to think about what park I'm hitting in. Uh, I just try to have good at bats and, and, and take good swings and, you know, and good results usually end up happening from that. So I, I don't really try to think about, you know, where I'm playing and uh, if it's big or, or small or whatever. You know, I just, just try to go out there and, and play and see what happens. Go to Brendan Cuddy. What'd you think of the cat? <laughs> yeah, that thing was... Uh, that thing was uh, pretty, pretty, pretty elusive to catch there. Uh, I, their tactics to get it, I think we could, we could work on. But uh, yeah, that thing was that thing was uh, was quick. So uh, I actually I actually called time because the, the the catcher and the umpire and you know judge they didn't see it. So I was like, hey, hey, hey. there's you know I pointed and they saw the cat. So it was uh, I just heard all the fans yelling and whatnot. But uh, pretty cool, I guess. Weird moment, but uh, interesting for baseball.